eyes and tens frames. Base ten blocks. Review. Let's start learning. Let's talk about subtraction. Say we want to solve this number sentence. 12 minus 5 equals blank. If we set the problem up with a tens frame, it will look like this. We have one full frame and a frame with just two. Let's stack the numbers. When we subtract, our greater number goes to the top. When we subtract 12 minus 5, we start in the ones column. We know we can't take 5 of something away from 2. There just aren't enough. So we regroup. That means we think of the 10 as 10 ones. Now we're dealing with 12 things rather than just 2, and we can subtract. We'll take away 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. What's left is a frame of 7. 12 minus 5 equals 7. By thinking of 12 ones instead of a 10 and a 2, we were able to solve. We regroup to find the difference. You did a great job listening. Another way to look at regrouping is to use base 10 blocks. Let's use a different number sentence. 22 minus 5 equals blank. Again, we stack the numbers and subtract in the ones. We can't take 5 away from 2. There aren't enough. So, that gives us a clue that we need to regroup. Here's what 22 looks like in base 10 blocks. We have two longs, or two tens, and two bits, or two ones. In order to take away five ones, we'll change one of the longs into 10 bits, like this. Now we have 12 bits, and we can take away five. One, two, three, four, five. We now have one long and seven bits. One ten and seven ones. That gives us seventeen. Twenty-two minus five equals seventeen. We just regroup while subtracting. Let's review. Let's review what we learned today. When we regroup in subtraction, we make one ten into ten ones. We can count back in tens frames to see what our answer is. Base 10 blocks also help us to see regrouping. In a stacked subtraction sentence, when the number on the bottom is greater than the number on the top, we're going to need to regroup. We take one of our tens and make it into 10 ones. One long becomes 10 bits. Then we do our subtraction and look at what's left to see what our answer is. That was really great. Now, we have a basic idea about regrouping when we subtract. Parents, teachers, and homework helpers, please subscribe and turn on those notifications. And why not give the video a like? It really helps my channel. I'm glad you were able to be here. Take care. See you next time, and remember, it never hurts to be nice.